There has been a very recent study coming out of Norway about a drug called rituximab. And what has happened is that rituximab, which is certainly not a chronic fatigue syndrome drug, because there is no drug specific for chronic fatigue syndrome, has been found to be effective in alleviating the symptoms of chronic fatigue syndrome. And the initial study seems to be that rituximab, despite it being a cancer drug, seems to have some immunological properties that restore normal function to at least some chronic fatigue syndrome patients. I think this is a very significant finding, certainly one worthy of further exploration, and it is certainly my hope that it will be explored further. And I believe that the organizations for which I work uh, will be very active in attempting to stimulate further research into not only rituximab, but other drugs which might also have immunological functions that might impact on chronic fatigue syndrome. I think this is an opportunity to open up a whole new approach to chronic fatigue syndrome therapy, and I am personally excited by it, and I hope that you will support further investigation of not only rituximab, but this category of drugs so that we can explore the possibility of developing effective therapeutic agents using an immunological approach to chronic fatigue syndrome.